and we are live. Hello everybody, Chef Kristen with Whole Health Every Day. All right, who do we got on here? I'll wait a little bit. Wait for some people to show up on here. Hello, hello, hello. <laughs> Happy Tuesday. Let's see. Anybody popping up? No. Mm. We can just start. We can just start. We're gonna do some chicken cordon bleu meatballs with some garlic chive mashed potatoes and some sauteed spinach. And over here I have my lovely assistant, China, my daughter. Hi. She's gonna be helping me today. So we're gonna go ahead and get started with our meatballs. So first thing, we're going to add our pound and a half of ground chicken, plop that right into the bowl. We're going to add our half cup of breadcrumbs, Ta -da. Ta -da. our one cup of shredded mozzarella cheese, and then we have our four slices of minced ham. Ta -da. Then we're going to crack an egg, and then we're going to also add our Dijon mustard. So crack that egg, get it going. Crack the egg, and then we want some salt and pepper for taste. About a tablespoon of salt and a teaspoon of pepper. Salt. Pepper. All right, there we go. I'm gonna go ahead and mix it all up and form our meatballs. Here, maybe I'll bring the camera over. Show sure everyone go. what you're doing here. This is here the fun go. part, the fun, messy part. And then if you happen to have any food allergies or any special type, special dietary needs, Instead of breadcrumbs, you can also use almond flour. That's another good alternative. So, small size meatballs. You don't want them too big. I make them either too big or too small. <laughs> Get these going. And then make sure you have your oven preset at 350 because these are going to bake for about 20 minutes. Good job, You're honey. a lot faster at it than I am. <laughs> Practice makes perfect. I'm trying. <laughs> oh, that's too small. That'll be okay. We'll add a little bit more. I have a little bit more, guys. You don't have to be perfect. It's okay. <laughs> it's an at-home meal. Yep. Get these rolling. We're almost done. Oh yeah, way faster than you. I know. <laughs> She's got like ten on here already. I've done three. <laughs> Let's compare our ball sizes. Oh, look. Here we go. <laughs> it's almost the same. <laughs> All right, just a couple more. There we go. We're going to just put that in one big one. Yeah, you want to make one big one? We'll make one big All right, one. we'll make one big one. <laughs> Awesome. All right, we go ahead and stick that in the oven. Okay. And yes, that will bake for about 20 minutes. And in the meantime, we already have our potatoes boiling. 
So we are going to go ahead and drain them. Do you want to bring a phone over? Yeah. People can see what we've got going on. Here we go. All right, what are we putting in? We have our garlic powder and we have our salt. I'm going to put that right in there. And then we already minced our chives. Well, and then we need our butter and our heavy whipping cream. About fourth a cup. And then half a stick of butter. And then we're just going to mash this up. This is the fun part. Get it nice and creamy. Make sure there's no chunks. Almost done. All right, there we go. Our mashed potatoes. Check it out, it looks yummy. All right, now we're gonna go ahead and set this to the side. And we're going to start on our sautéed spinach. Okay. So get that ready. Let's sauté some spinach. <laughs> All right, so we're going to do medium heat on the stove top. Add a tablespoon of olive oil or avocado oil, whichever you prefer. And then we're going to add a little bit more garlic powder and a little bit more salt. Bring it over to Bring it over. There we go. Ingredients in. And let's cut the pan a little bit. And these are going to cook super fast. In goes our spinach. There we go. Saute it for a little bit. It happens when it happens. Was it meant to be? Wanted to wilt just a little bit. Almost done. Oh, there's another one. That's okay. Almost done. See how they're just starting to wilt now? So it's almost done. There we go. Alright. We're going to go ahead and turn this off and put the lid on. Leave it be. Right. Pretty easy, pretty simple. Hey. Yeah? Let's bring it right back around. Pons of ingredients away. And then at the very end, you have your finished product, which is your cordon bleu meatballs, your sauteed spinach, and then we have our chive garlic whipped potatoes. Yum. Bon appetit. Enjoy. <laughs> Yay.